a local ambulatory services, making sure that distractions are never the cause of an accident. Eyewitness News reporter Kevin Hayes is live for us tonight in the studio with more from an award-winning service on what they're doing to make their responses safer. Kevin? Nick and Candace, it's a sticker that's only about two square inches in size, but it backs a policy that is personal to one local EMS crew. Want to ask us how we developed this or why we're doing this? We'll provide you with all the information you want. This little sticker could be the most important piece of safety equipment on this Greater Pittston Area Regional Ambulance. It's a sterile cockpit sticker and it represents a growing trend in the EMS community. It's basically to keep uh, the cockpit safe, not to start the driver when they're going to an emergency or taking a patient to the hospital. The sticker backs a policy that civilians are not permitted to drive in the cab of the ambulance. This cuts down on the distractions that have statistically raised the amount of ambulance involved crashes nationwide. One of the major risks was having distractions in the cab and one of the biggest distractions was having a non-member of the crew in the um, transport unit. It's understandable for family to become angry when a loved one is hurt, but this rule protects everyone, including the victim. Mostly it's, I'd say it's been taken, I've been taken well by our people that we take, but you have some that argue about it. Crews at Greater Pittston cite an accident two years ago where their crew wasn't distracted but were involved, and if a civilian had been in that cockpit, it could have been fatal. At the end of the day, it's about the safety and care for everyone involved. We're kind of taught to, hey, you're calling us for help. We're going we're gonna to try to do our job as best as we can for you. To do that, we need certain things to kind of line up for us. By not adding that distraction, it allows us to provide the best care that we can and deliver um, the patient to the definitive care as safely um, and as quickly as possible. Now, there are extenuating circumstances where a crew can allow someone into the passenger's side, but these situations are extremely rare and based solely on that passenger being vital to the care of the patient in the back. Reporting live in studio, Kevin Hayes, Eyewitness News. Kevin, thank you. And Chief Zaffron and company were recognized earlier this year as the 2019 Pennsylvania Department of Health's EMS Agency of the Year.